the ideal angle, according to uh, the manufacturer of the Tour Angle 144, is 144 degrees uh, between the club shaft and the forearms. Um, Dave's pretty close to that. Uh, let's go ahead and watch his swing in slow motion, see what he does. Takes it back nicely. Club head blocks our view of the hands like it's supposed to. Shoulders coming down pretty good. Gets to the top, out flies, the, and then over the top he comes. So he loses that tour angle of 144 degrees. And you can see what that does is, is with his hands way out here, he's really high. He's got to manipulate the club to get it back to the ball. And again, he's not getting what we call centrifugal or centripetal force, depending on how you call it, that he could generate if his hands were a little lower and he was able to swing the club or rotate the club around the forearms. So the club needs to rotate around the forearms. The other thing we're looking at here is that he has a tough time getting off his back leg. Some of that is back issues. Uh, but the thing he's working on is not pulling that left elbow behind him like that. That's pulling the club in and, and decreasing his speed. So we're going to have him keep the left elbow a little bit more out in front of him and get off that back foot.